Okay, it's a 2007 Ford Edge rear wheel bearing. I get out of there, kind of a pain in the neck to get these bolts in the back. After you get your brakes off and your rotor, use some kind of tool to hold your axle in a little bit like that. And then the, the trick is these bolts in here, they hit the tone ring on your axle and you try to get a tool in there. So you can't fit a tool on those bolts. I already have two of them loose there. I'll show you how I got them loose here. These, this is a Snap-on T60. That's a Napa Carlisle T60. None of those work, they both hit the tone ring. What I did was I took a Carlisle Napa T55 and removed the bit. And then I took a 12 millimeter socket and I put it right in there. And you can round it off easily. So what I suggest is once you get, here I'll have Matt hold that. Once you get your tool in there, Once you get the tool in there, once you get your tool in position and you get it ready, then you gotta grab a torch. If you don't have a torch, you can maybe use a propane torch. You gotta heat it. The only reason I suggest heating it is because if you turn it, if it's too hard to turn, you'll round it out in there. Because obviously it's not the right size socket for that bolt. So I throw a little heat on it just to make sure and it comes off easy. You just heat around the hub. Get it nice and hot so that you don't have to use a lot of force to remove the bolt. Like I said, if you don't have a settling torch, you could just use propane as long as you get it nice and warm. This is a Syracuse car, so it's going to be a lot, a lot of rust on there. And once you get it hot, it should crack loose without rounding off. There it goes. So that's the main trick to getting the bolts out. After you get all the bolts out, it's just like doing a normal hub. Uh, I suggest leaving the bolts in there and not taking them all the way out because they will come out and eventually hit the tone ring. But that's the trick. Makes life a lot easier than undoing the whole suspension, especially when you have a rusty car like this.